become a second home for the Boston team. How does it feel to be here? Well, yeah, you can say that. Um, it, feels, it feels great again, especially for me because I know I know St. Louis, I know the field, so it feels uh, always uh, good to, to be back. Could you imagine years back playing here and done fun coming back with the Bosnian national team? No, that's, that's the one thing I've been thinking about the whole time. Just amazing what, what happened, actually. But uh, I just try to enjoy it. Uh, the time and and not really to think about it right now because when I get old and, and finish my <laughs> career, I'll have time to think about it. You guys have been here. When you, the crowd support you guys get when you've been here and you've played in various cities. What what is that, what is that like to feel the support of the Bosnians in America? Well, that's something that actually pushes us to to, to, to play well and, and to, to get results everywhere we play. Even in Europe, uh, different countries, our people gather and, and support us, and um, it's just an uh, amazing feeling, and gives us definitely uh, uh, more more um, force to, to, to play. How does the team look right now after however much time you've had in camp? We had a great great first uh, ten days in Sarajevo, and it, it's been a little bit tough for for some some players that. Had a break and, and stuff, but um, it was um, successful uh, first 10 days, and now it was yesterday a little tough road. We have to uh, take it easy today, but uh, we ha we still have some time to, to get a little in shape. And it looks good right now. Hey, you guys had a rough day of travel yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> it was very rough. But like I said, we had a good training today and uh, tried to sweat it off and. and uh, um, for, for the next, uh, How do you prepare for Argentina? What do you think of facing them? Well, it's it's going to be our toughest toughest game uh, for sure in the group. But right now, uh, we just want to get in shape as, as good as we can and and not really think think about the the, the World Cup games right now. And I'm I'm sure that the coach is going to find the, the the right team and the right way to to play them, even though it's going to be very tough because we all know how, how strong they are. The last, the last game you guys had with them, kind of afterward, people were saying, showed a gap between where you guys and, and Argentina were. Do you feel as you guys have made progress on closing that gap? Well, uh, that was, that was uh, a, a very bad game from our side, and I'm sure we can play much better than that, but it still um, don't change the, the, the fact that Argentina is, is a, one of the best teams in the world, and, and it's still going to be a tough game in, in Brazil, but I but I think it's going to be a much different game than, than it was uh, in the summer. And you've played a really aggressive style and been scoring a lot of points. Does that any chance that has to change at all going into the pool? Well, I don't think we can uh, change that uh, quick, as, as quick as, as we should maybe for, for, the, for the game against Argentina. We, we have too many offensive players that just like to attack and, and score the goals, and um, we'll see. We'll see what what the coach decides for for each and every game separately. And is the uh, game against Ivory Coast? What does that offer to you for your team? Well, Ivory Coast is a, is a is a good team. Is a, one of the top African teams. Um, I think uh, maybe we can uh, prepare for for Nigeria because they could probably uh, be the team uh, fighting with, for that second second place in the group. So I'm sure that it's going to be a tough game where, where we're going to face another tough opponent. How was it in being back in Bosnia for 10 days? Because with the, with the flooding going on, how was, how were, what was the situation like? Well, yeah, the, the, the flooding uh, situation changed everything. And uh, that was the, the most important thing everybody was talking about and thinking about. So we all kind of try to of course train and, and, and prepare but put that aside and, and kind of get involved and and help help people that are that are um, infect, uh, affected and that's that's what took some some thoughts uh, um, from from training and stuff but we, we, are, we are people and we have to we have to help the people that, that got affected Okay, sorry. Thank you.